This machine that we're going to talk about now is the MVM4. This machine has graduated from the 1970s in a geared knee machine that was very similar to this. This is the fourth generation of this basic design. It's a large vertical mill. It's designed for much heavier parts and much heavier cutting. It has some special features that have been brought into it in the last year. We sell two versions of it. We sell a version that is the geared variable speed design with pulleys and belts. And then this new design, we have variable feed rates and we have variable spindle speeds. Main spindle motor is five horsepower. A variable speed using what they call an, an inverter drive. The inverter drive will change the RPMs through a potentiometer and then we give your RPMs are shown in the top. What's important on this machine, which is a little bit uh, unique, not many machines have this design, is the table is nearly as long as the support. So this is the support of the table, and this is the table length. And if you look carefully, you'll see that the table is only about eight inches longer than the actual saddle. So what it does is it gives it an extreme amount of support. Most milling machines have a small saddle and a long table. Uh, this one is unique. Instead of having an Acme lead screw on the X and the Y, it has a ball screw which gives it very, very easy movement of the table with very little effort. And it's extremely accurate because it's a ball screw. It's very, very accurate lead screw. Column, extremely heavy. And the column has block ways. This is the way surfaces here. And these are designed block, which makes it very, very rugged. The cross travel is block ways and your uh, vertical travel is block ways. And the table is always a dovetail or or V-ways on the table. The electric panel is very complete. It will basically protect the motor in all of its operations, the features, and protects all of the features. So it's got over load and under load protection. So if you have a low voltage problem, it'll shut it down and won't burn the motor out. All your surfaces are hardened and ground, uh, X, Y, and Z. So the, the life expectancy is very, very, very good. The, uh, the dials, the dials are all standard dials. Most machines will go out with a digital readout. Uh, we offer the digital readout uh, for a, a new wall or a Fagor or an Accurite. Uh, all are available normally from stock. The base is designed to bolt the machine down to the floor. It has the bolts positions and they're supplied with the uh, toolbox that comes with it. It comes with the Allen wrenches and the, all the standard wrenches that you need to operate the machine. I think that's really probably all we need to say about it. I think we covered it all.